Effects of speeding tickets on insurance premiums Responsible adults accept their mistakes and learn from it. Our first reaction to a speeding ticket might be to get angry with the law enforcers and start cursing. However, it should sink in pretty quickly as we understand exactly why we are facing for such punishment. If we are not sorry yet by the time renewal terms arrive we will be after seeing an increase in our premium. Insurers will keep checking the driver records and make adjustments to rate offers as soon as they find a negative note. The effects of it will depend on your age, history and any other tickets or fines. An older driver with a very long clean history may not see much of a difference after one traffic violation. However, if a younger driver has been getting these all along, the last one might be the one to break camel's back. A carrier can decide that enough is enough and offload the offending policyholder at the first chance. It is only a wise business decision to let the customer go before these violations turn into accidents and claims. Statistically, flashy autos attract more tickets from police officers. Even the color of a car can increase the counts. Driving a red, green and silver color autos is far more likely to draw attention than others. Studies show that police officers are more likely to hand tickets to the drivers of a fire engine red convertible than a low-key family car. Probably drivers of such vehicles have had similar theories and this is the confirmation that they were not wrong. It may be extreme to choose the color of the vehicle or go for more conservative automobile. Still it is a good idea to find ways of avoiding those penalties. Some people openly argue that you should try to fight a penalty notice in the court. Furthermore, they claim that most drivers would have a pretty good chance of escaping them with a little bit of coaching. Maybe the costs of legal representation or taking the time to prepare yourself for the court appearance will be much less than the increased premiums for the next several years. Of course, the consequences of repeatedly offending can be loss of license. In the license point deduction systems people can quickly fit the maximum allowed points before they lose the license. This would be highly costly and embarrassing since you will be like a kid who needs his mum to drop him to school. Or worse, you will end up in a ditch one of those days. As the number of traffic violations increase, it will be harder to find a decently priced policy. It will be a case of choosing the less costly one rather than hoping to find an economical one. As a general rule, the higher the premium the more reason you have to shop around for better deals. A 10% discount on a $3,000 premium would be $300. This is not a bad figure if you can find it with half an hour of effort online.